Peace and love to the Universal Family. My name is Cloxon. I have a question for my audience. What would your life be like if you had faith and trust in yourself? You know, I've realized that life is about the culmination of decisions that you make. You know, what your life will be, what it is, what it already has been, is based on every decision you've made of your entire life. And when you break down those decisions, you realize the reason why you made that decision is based on the, the exact mental state you were at at the time, you know? And it pondered to me like, wow, a lot of the reasons why our lives might not be where we wanted to be is because of the mental mind state we were in when we made a specific decision that we may regret or whatnot, right? And so the key to that is to analyze and realize, oh wow, did I make that decision out of fear? Did I make that decision out of uncertainty, out of insecure uh, thoughts, you know? And so that's why I wanna ask you, like, what would your life be like if you had faith and trust in yourself? No doubt that you could do anything you put your mind to. What would your decisions be then? What would you choose to do, you know? And that's, that's a real big question I had to ask myself, like, wow, Clarkson, a good chunk of decisions you've made you're proud of and when you analyze those decisions, you analyze where your mind was at. Like, wow, my mind was in a very positive state. A very, um, like, I had a gross mindset. I still do. And when I analyzed that exact moment, I was like, that, that was in my gross mindset. Like, I was thinking about the things that I wanted to do and how I wanted to do them. And I knew without a shadow of a doubt in my mind that I could do them. And because of that mindset, I made certain decisions. I, I started this podcast and did this. And that, in turn turn into what it is today and I'm proud of those decisions and then I look at other decisions like damn why did I make that why did I not do this because the decision isn't necessarily an action it's just a state of being because sometimes a decision could be to not do something and that could be to your detriment you know the decision isn't always to oh go to this place or leave or do this sometimes the decision is to not do something and those could be very detrimental y'all so especially talking to myself like there's a lot of things that I missed out on because of the decisions I made, you know? Like it was even something yesterday that I, I was pondering over. I'm like, dang, should I go to this La Russell event that just happened to be free that I could have easily went to? And I decided not to. And I'm like, huh. Now that I'm pondering today, that might not have been the best decision, y'all. <laughs> you know? Because things could have happened in my favor. But my mind got in the way. My negative mind, you know, the mind with the doubt got in favor. It's like, nah. I probably wouldn't be able to showcase La Russell or anything anyway. He probably wouldn't even rock with some of my beats that I have anyway. You know, he probably we, we probably wouldn't meet each other. He probably be a bunch of people there. You know, a, a, a million excuses went into my mind that ended up deciding for me and making me make the decision of not going, even though I could have gone. He was he's in he was in L.A. yesterday. He's probably still in L.A. today, but there was an event that he was gonna be at either today or tomorrow that cost right. I was going to pay for it, but then I ended up finding out yesterday that it was sold out. So I'm like, dang, I can't go. But he posted on his stories, he's going to be at this other place for like a few hours. It's completely free. It's just a free pop-up in LA. I'm like, wow, what, is it? what are the odds? The show is, is full, but this event is free, and I can pull up. It only takes me two hours to get there. They'll still be there for another two hours. So one side of my mind is like, you know what, maybe I can do this. This is my chance. And then the other side of me just like, nah. It isn't gonna work, you're tired. You don't wanna go outside today. You didn't, you didn't plan to go outside today. It was just a random Instagram post you passed by. You weren't prepared. You don't know what you're going, you know what I'm saying, do there. So all these things got in the way of the decision making, y'all. And I was like, dang. Looking at it in hindsight, I'm like, I don't, anything could have could have happened. I could have met him face to face. I could have showed him one of my beats. Who knows? Could have been on the La Russell team, you know? So it's like, those decisions are crucial, y'all. These are like life and death decisions. And when I mean life and death, I mean living your life or you slowly dying. Because there are stages of death. It doesn't always mean a physical death. I'm dead. Like there are mental stages of death. There are slowly deteriorating. I know, I've seen and know people who like are slowly dying every single day. And it's crazy to see. You know, and those are just reminders to keep living. To keep living your fullest. Without fear and doubt that you can't do what you set out to do. You know? So I want to ask y'all that. What... What would you do and what would your life be like? What type of decisions would you make if you had complete and utter faith and trust in yourself? No doubt, you know? 
what type of decision would you make? I know the type of decisions I would make, you know? I definitely know the type of decisions I would make. So I wanna ask y'all, what would y'all make? Would you, would you go to that special place you always wanted to? Would you travel, you know? Would you take on this job? Would you make, start your own business? If you had no doubt and you completely trusted that you knew what, what you were doing, and even if you didn't know at the moment, you trusted that you could learn to do it, you know? If you, if you knew like, okay, I wanna learn piano, but I doubt that I'll ever be good at it. But you change your mindset to I trust and have faith that I will be good at it if I put the time in, you know? And that changes the whole mindset of, okay, the decision to now practice piano, you know? Versus I'm never gonna learn it and then you never practice it. Two different decisions, two different mindsets. So what would you do, y'all, if you had trust and faith that you could do anything you wanted to do? What decision would you make? Would you learn piano? Would you would you travel to that place? Would you talk to that guy or not talk to that girl? You know, what would you do, y'all? What would you do? That's the question for today, y'all. It ain't gonna be a long video. I just wanted to pose that thought to y'all. Um, I know what I'm gonna do, and I'm gonna, I decided to make this video. That's my decision. And my next decision is to work on this music, y'all. Got an event to come in tomorrow. So I think I'm, I'm gonna decide to make some more beats and, and get to work on that, all right? Cause I trust that my beats are fire. And I trust that people are gonna love it cause I love it. And it's gonna continue to pave the way for my legendary legacy. You know, every piece is another piece to the puzzle. And I believe in myself and I believe in that vision that I have. So y'all should too. Y'all should believe in your own vision. That's the message for today, y'all. Peace and love. Clocks and out.